when you went and did a trial, they left loads of water <laughs> behind the, the caravan where you, that you were in. So I think it was Shane that discovered it. He went, when you go down there, behind the caravan number one, there's a massive barrel of fresh water. <laughs> 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 Mr. Vernon K. Yay! Yay! Oh! Hey, Hello. Vernon! Hi Dominic, hi Christopher, morning Pippa, hi, and yeah. that kid, that kid who's producing. Can I just say, because I've not spoken to you since the jungle, we loved you in the jungle, Vern, in our house. It was oh, brilliant. thank you, Dominic. Honestly, it was great to watch. I just wouldn't be good on I'm a Celeb because uh, we had uh, Tiff's niece um, last week and we we took her to Go Ape, you know, the treetop adventure oh, yeah. place. I, yeah. pa- I papped myself. Oh, come on, Chris. I, I, I'm, and I realised I'm more scared of heights than I actually genuinely thought I was. And I knew I was scared of heights. A man called Steve had to walk you around, didn't and he? This, no, this guy was behind me with his daughter who was mm. talking me across all the bridges. You yeah. be- <laughs> He goes, you'll be fine. You've got this. Don't worry about it. Meanwhile, his daughter's like doing it. She's hanging off stuff with one yeah. arm. But you did yeah, it, Yeah, but right? the thing is, Chris, is when, when you're doing stuff like that, uh, you've got no choice but to do it because 14 million people are watching. And well, you no, think, I, all right. I Unless you're that. Jordan North and you cry <laughs> at everything. <laughs> you just kind of go, all right, I've got to do this. The kids are watching. Tess has been really supportive. I didn't realise at the time, but she was. Yeah. Uh, and you just kind of, you just think, right, I've got to do it. And... What it was for me, the Friday when we stood in, I can't remember what it was called, some game where we're all in a line. And I didn't read, it didn't click in me mentally that I was doing I'm a Celebrity. Even though I'd been isolating for two weeks before, it didn't click. Because you, co- you weren't in the jungle, I guess. Exactly. That's- yeah. So everything mm. was a new experience and we were the first to have done it. And it didn't click until the cockroaches fell on top of us and everyone started screaming. And I see Anton Deck laughing. And the light bulb came on then, and it was like, I'm doing I'm a Celebrity. This is real. This mm-hmm. is I'm actually in it now. Is there anything that you can tell us that no one knows about I'm a Celeb? We were driven in separate buggies down to the trial area, mm-hmm. sat in a waiting room till they got ready, because Anton Deck had some pre-records to do yeah. at the end of the show. Uh, so it takes about an hour and a half, and then they say, right, come on in. And then you do it. But the arena where all those trials was built was unbelievable, Chris. It was like the best wacky warehouse I've ever seen. <laughs> See, if I was in that waiting room waiting to do a trial, I'd go out of my mind. Be so yeah, yeah, a lot of people did. You know, there, there was a lot of vaping and a lot of cigarettes for, on the uh. smokers during, during that room. But the best thing about that was we were drinking campfire water. So we were boiling water on the campfire and it tasted a bit smoky. It tasted rotten. But when you went and did a trial... They left loads of water <laughs> behind the, the caravan where you, that you were in. So I think it was Shane that discovered it. He went, when you go down there, behind the caravan number one, there's a massive barrel of fresh water. <laughs> so, so we would, nip, oh, I just need a wee. We'd nip off, pretend we're going to the toilet, fill our canteens up with this fresh water and then go back in. There you go. Uh, so you've, so no, the, you've no idea. No what, idea. What time it is until you, you get the feeling that the show is going... You know, well, w- what was nice was we we heard Anton Deck record the "I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here" because they were only next door in the in, uh, in outside the castle, so we heard them record that. So oh, we I thought, see. right, the air got it goes on air at nine, pre-record probably eight o'clock ish, right? And we knew that the sun set at around four ish. Oh my god, that's so weird. Yeah, it was weird because we weren't going to bed till three. And then they were waking up, us, waking us up at mid at midday, one o'clock. So our clocks were all over the place. But they did say, "Prepare yourself for jet lag, as if you've been to and from New York." That's right. how they prepared us. And who who made who snored the most? Oh, she'll kill me if I mention a name. Oh well, but there you go, Beverly Callard. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> oh, she's great. Does this camera not turn around? Can I not see Dominic and and Pippa? It's all fixed, I think. Is we it? have yeah, we have to, we have to cut cameras. It's fixed, fixed all. Yeah, it's but let's, listen, be honest. There's, like, there's a camera on you. There's a camera on me. As long as the two stars are seen, this well, you is know it. what more yeah, do the yeah, viewers want? So. Oh, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, gang. Lovely to see you. Hi, Ben. Nice to see you, mate. Yeah, and you, pal. Hi, well, Pippa. Hey, Aww. Pippa, congratulations. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. thanks very much. Is Chris going to DJ at the wedding? I haven't asked him yet, but I'm going to. All right. So, uh, yeah, that's coming. Bye, Vernon. Oh, <laughs> oh God. <laughs> See you, love. Bye, guys. Bye.